Hi Gemini, welcome to this community. My name's Sophia. So what I was getting was disappointment. I was getting the Six of Cup, Six of Cups energy. Um, so uh, it was connected with past life. So some of you might be going and doing some past life connection stuff, finding out about your past life or trying to cut the tie of the past life, trying to end that cycle past life. But uh, disappointed in like it's like this is my person from past life and it's just not working out something like that so I couldn't get more than that at the moment so let's see why what's going on with your person that kind of thing There's something that's enlightening you as well so I, I, I need to know what well let's see if that comes out <clears throat> oh maybe the universe has enlightened you to this is your person but you're like well disappointed but i feel like that the universe is showing no this is your person so get on and do the work but there's been an enlightenment of this is your person something like that anyway oh, let's go deeper Right, so Queen of Swords, it's interesting, I wasn't getting that energy, so I'll see what this is. This line is not what I'm feeling for you. <clears throat> Queen of Swords, Three of Wands, ah, so it could be a front, or there's another way of seeing it. Queen of Swords, Three of Wands, and Three of Cups. So, <clears throat> I feel you're like, like there's a separation here, and... That could have been an argument and you're doing all right but you're waiting for your person to come back because you've released him him or her with these two cards but energetically still in the picture that's your person this is a twin flame soulmate style this i pull in people into my reality my purpose my mission on this planet is to help people to do their mission your mission is you're an alien being, you're different. You feel different than everyone else. You may not think you do because you, you generally, most people think everyone thinks the same. No, they generally, um, you are here to do something to change planet Earth and that's generally changing someone's life. So you have a connection with someone on this planet that helps you to do that. Most people don't know that and they don't know why they think no, the, the connection is totally different than what you feel it to be. When you think of a soul's person, that's why I was getting the six of cups, you think it's your soul and your soul is going to be the same as that person. No, but physicality and programming changes that soul essence. The energetic frequency you're aligned with, but the, the, the actual 3D world changes this person. And that is intentional, the contract, so that you work on yourself and blah, blah, blah. That's all in my playlist. Why I'm saying that is because there's been an off. You've cut out your person, you've released him, but you're still energetically connected because this is your person. That's your soul's contract from 5D, regardless if you're, you're like, Sophia, I'm, I'm a soulmate working as a hairdresser. You feel compelled, you have an inner calling to change planet Earth, right? That's why you're watching this video. And that's why I'm here to guide you to get to that core essence of why you're here. But there's a third party in between. Now, the third party doesn't need to be a, 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 a girlfriend or something like that, which most, um, not intentionally, but third party is known how they say it with other people, right? But this is to do with uh, confidence of yourself, really. But third party is anything that's stopping you from getting with your person. It doesn't have to be uh, another person. It could be, for example, oh, your person feels he has to work 20 hours a day, right? That's third party. Your person is 100 miles away. That's third party. Anything that is an extension of you is a third right so this is about so you cut them off from this third party situation but with the queen of swords is like the sword to me in my reading this is my reading right not other tower readings this reading sword down is a lie so you're lying to yourself the sword down is in the snow can you see the snow so you're lying to yourself um and being left out in the cold because of you think is about the physicality because look she looks quite good to me 
um, and you're stubborn thinking to this, oh, well, I'm, you know, I'm quite successful. I'm doing all right. I'm a queen, right? I'm just going to sit here and wait for my person. That's what she's doing. So I get a bloody focus. Yeah. Anyway, there. She's waiting for a person, right? And um, not going within because the third eye here with this crown thing. Round her, which I'm picking up with this reading. Jesus. That's the thing we're doing, Tao. Where'd you put the card? So it focuses in. See that? That's on her third eye. But to me, when it's uh, clear like that, that's not a colour. That means mystery. Unclear. So that means you're not tapping into your intuition in, uh, and stuff like that. So that means you're just logicating, but logicating is not enough. So you're doing things that are incorrect, right? So you might look good. You might be in a job that's okay, but it's incorrect. That's why your person's still in the picture. The third party, which is reflecting of you with your person, is you also having this third party of following a belief, a tradition of religion of I've just got to get stable look good and then the person comes towards you i reckon in this reading you have someone who's completely opposite carefree that is um probably not working all the time might be smoking drugs the opposite and that's what i said at the beginning most don't understand that they are the opposite so they pull you out of what you are so thick on your third party which is like i said following beliefs traditions stubbornly to it this could be um going from family tradition into college, into university, making your way up the ladder, right? And your person is carefree. They teach you the opposite. It's about yin and yang, which is on on this planet, the different polarities, which is on the back of my card, right? Or, well, not all cards, most of my cards. Underneath is, like I said, uh, well, I didn't, but is what's hidden with the moon card underneath you is what I'm saying. You're just focusing on the physicality. You're not going deeper. The moon card has a pond. Now the pond is, the moon is dark. So you can't see how deep the pond, how do you know how deep it is? You might have a small pond, right? But how do you know how deep it goes? This, this contract from 5D that you agreed to in this past life, I'm feeling six of cups in this reading, but you've forgotten everyone on 3D plane right that has a contract well, everyone was chosen even soulmates right that's why i have a community for soulmates um soulmate twin flames whatever label you have all to be on this planet this is a unique planet you made a contract to be here soulmates are to build but there are soulmates that still feel to be humanitarians that's why i do build the soulmate community right so my stuff can help you to be a humanitarian i can help you be independent that way this is what's hidden you're just staying in the 3D, doing your job over there, feeling different, not understanding that you're different for a reason. And you've had this soul connection with this person, right? And you're like, why aren't they coming towards me? I'm doing good. I'm okay. I'm da da da. So you're logicating it. You're not actually understanding it with the moon card. This is also shadow work you need to do. And this is um, getting the strength to do it. This is connected with Lionsgate portal of why this is happening. This is about being still, the art of stillness. And look, following a belief system, see the tradition, see he looks like he's praying and all this kind of thing, praying by the uh, the window. But this is dead and buried. Like I said, you, I feel there's energy of their past life. So you could be, oh, well, I'm going to try to do a past life cutting cord connection, which is absolute bullshit. If you've done it, uh, please, right? If you're going to think about doing a cutting cord, right, um, you can tell them, direct them to me, and I will say to them, do you know about energy? Go and look in the nucleus of an atom and tell me what is in that. And that is energy. Nucleus of an atom is energy, right? This world is energy. Everything is energy, meaning there's nothing in the nucleus. So how can you cut nothing, right? It's bullshit. It's a scam. And they're taking money from you, if you're thinking about that, because I'm picking up this. You've either done it and you've wasted your money. And if you're going to do something, intuition, get the money back guarantee with it, right? I have a money back guarantee on everything I say. My Everything. I would money back guarantee this reading. I money back guarantee the playlist, but they're free. Everything I say, I money back guarantee because it's from upstairs. 
they've I channel it whatever you want to call it I don't like to call it channeling because they still give their opinion and makes my channeling look like theirs I don't add my opinion other channelers do which is why it's fucked I'll just be honest like I said, I've been mentioning intuition. This is about intuition. You know why there's a third party with your person, but you're blocking your intuition. You're unsure of why this is happening. It's like uh, there's a third party that's uh, like attracts like. You attract a third party because your third party is a belief, a tradition, a religion that you must have someone show up in that dead and buried it's like he's dead, right? This looks like dead in his graveyard at a funeral. Dead and buried, rooted belief systems, right? You could just be doing, well, I do a little bit of meditation for swords. I'm like, oh, how's that work for you, right? Go and look at all those thousands of views and videos of meditation. Has planet Earth been uh, fixed by meditation? Has planet Earth, this is intuition. Has planet Earth been uh, fixed by yoga? Has planet Earth been uh, fixed by uh, crystals or just tower readings? This is about taking action and you controlling your life. If you want to know how to do that, to change this new cycle that's starting, then book me. Like I said, is a 100% money back guarantee. Check out the playlist. The playlist is free. The playlist proves I know my shit. Or just go ahead and book me. I repeat again. It's a money-back guarantee. There's nothing for you to lose. I'm out. Speak to you later.